Hello friends. Welcome back to our channel. In today's video, we are going to discuss how to enable USB debugging on a locked Android phone. So, let's start the video. Before heading towards the solution, make sure to like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. First way, enable USB debugging by unlocking the screen lock. In the first method of enabling USB debugging on the locked Android phone, we are going to unlock the phone screen using the Android Unlock tool. First, download the Android Unlock tool on the PC and then follow the instructions given in the user guide to unlocking your phone screen. You can find the download link and user guide link in the description box below. This tool is the best option to bypass any kind of screen lock on all Android phones. Once you have unlocked your Android phone, it's time to enable USB debugging. For this, open the phone settings. Go to the About Phone. Tap 7 times on the build number to enable the developer mode. After enabling the developer mode, go back to the settings screen. Now, go to System Option. Then tap on the Developer Options. Search for the USB debugging option and enable it by pressing the toggle button. Second way, enable USB debugging by factory resetting phone. In this method, you need to factory reset your phone to bypass the Android phone screen lock and enable the USB debugging option. Before moving with the video make sure to back up your phone as performing a factory reset on your phone will remove all the data. To factory reset your phone, first, turn off your phone. Now, long press the power and volume down buttons at the same time to enter into the recovery mode. The key combination for entering the recovery mode varies with the phone model, so make sure to find out the key combination for your phone. You need to hold the buttons unless you see the Android bootloader menu on the screen. Now, select the recovery mode by pressing the power button. After entering the recovery mode, use the volume down button to go to the factory reset option, and to select it press the power button. Now, the phone will start the process. After the completion of the factory resetting process, restart your phone and you will be able to access the phone without the password. Now, to enable the USB debugging use the same steps mentioned in the previous method. Even though both ways work when you wish to enable the USB debugging option on the locked Android phone, we will suggest you go for the first option as it is the safest way of doing this without losing any data. Whereas, if you will opt for the second option, you may end up losing your phone data. So, go for the safer option. With this, we end our video. We hope you liked this video. If you want to see more useful Android related videos, then stay tuned with us by subscribing to our channel and pressing the bell icon so that you get notifications each time we upload a new video. Thank you.